This is LifeLock, and it's pretty awesome. So imagine if this is a leak in one of your walls at home, whether it's from rains, floods, whatever. Check this out, guys. Yeah. In this episode, we're going to talk about how you could protect your home from this coming rainy season, the preparations you need to do, the things you may want to buy to prepare for any unfortunate events, including these types of things. Now, some of the items we'll be talking about will be completely free and the rest of the items will be very, very cheap and easy to get if you use our sponsor for today, which is GrabMart and GrabExpress. Especially ngayon na sobrang rainy and we don't want to leave the house, it will come very, very handy. But more on that later. Okay, guys, it's very, very gloomy. I hope I don't get struck by lightning. First tip, guys, is very, very simple and easy to do, but you have to climb your roof. And that is to clean your gutters. Grabe yung thunderstorm and I'm afraid of baka nandun ako with the tripod and the camera ako yung target ng lightning patay tayo dyan Ooh. Speaking of rainy season buti na lang bumaba ako guys mukhang no hope to finish the video today I'll see you guys tomorrow Wait, wait meron pala akong tip for times like this guys when it's super, super rainy, like today, and my thunderstorm talaga. I walk around the house and tinitingnan ko yung lahat ng mga ceilings namin, especially in the rooms na bihira ko lang pinupuntahan. And I'll check for droplets of water. I usually have a flashlight with me. I'll check the ceiling and the floor if there's like pooling of water. And I'll take note of that. Now, okay, there's a leak right above this area. We'll talk about how to repair these leaks later on. Okay, tomorrow na tayo. Okay, day two and it's finally, finally sunny. And back to our topic. First thing you have to do is to make sure your gutters are clean. Now, this actually happened to us. Napunuto ng mga ganito and leaves yung downspout namin going down. And in the middle of the night, I was trying to get water and napansin ko, uy, baha yung gym namin, which is right underneath this where we are right now. Naisip ko, it's probably the gutters because nakikita ko may streaks na on the wall, may puddles na everywhere. So I climbed up here in the raining night at 2 a.m. And nakita ko nga na punong-puno na ng tubig dito and it was overflowing na. And that is why before the rainy season starts, we have to check our gutters. That it's clean from any debris and it's free from anything. Kasi paminsan, you see these mga brown things, it piles up mga soil, mga dirt, mga dust. And in the most extreme circumstances, merong mga halaman na nag-grow. Ito guys, oh. merong mga halaman because the soil piles up and nag-grow. Now this one is at the back of our gutter. I'll clean that later. But the worst case is if it blocks the water going to the drainage down below. So make sure the gutters are clean before the rainy season starts. Okay, second thing to do is to make sure your drains are cleaned and the canals are cleaned. So in this house, ang nilalagay namin is these transparent ones so nakikita namin kung madumi na ba or if it gets clogged. Now, yung sa side namin, it gets clogged quite a bit kasi meron kaming nilalagay na screen. Kasi napansin namin, dito dumadaan yung mga daga. And may mga bite marks na to. So alam namin they're trying to get in here. So we've placed them there talaga. But sometimes may mga dahon, may mga dumidumi, may mga debris that gets clogged here. So we clean them regularly talaga. So that's one of the causes na paminsan nakikita natin na may tubig na umaapaw when it gets really, really rainy. This one, the canals, and yung mga manholes. Yung mga manholes are those square things that you open up. 
those can get filled really quickly with debris, with dirt, with dust, soil, and everything else. So make sure to clean that regularly as well. So far, we've been talking about how to prepare yung mga before anything happens. Ito yung gagawin natin. And that's the best talaga. But sometimes, hindi natin maiiwasan na may leaks pa rin yung roof natin, may mga walls na nagli-leak, or yung mga doors natin sa ilalim may pumapasok na tubig. And these are where these items, actually, ang dami kong mga gamit. Meron akong kumpletong dito. I have a lot of things to do DIY around the house. Not everyone wants to have all these items. So I thought, what is the bare minimum? And this is the first aid kit for the rainy season. These will be the most essential, the cheapest, and the easiest to use. And all of these items can be purchased from our sponsor for today, which is Grab Mart and Grab Express. So if you're like me and you've been using Grab already, you would know that Grab Mart has all these mga groceries, liquor, beverages, completo. But na discover ko na, na meron din pala silang areas where you can buy all the tools that you need for your home. Merong home improvement portion ang Grab. So it has batteries, it has all these things we're going to talk about. And lahat ng mga options dito are available 24-7. But sabihin natin, parang hindi ko nahanap yung gusto ko dun sa Grab Mart mismo. Or parang the store or the hardware that I want, wala sa Grab Mart. Well, pwede natin gamitin si Grab Express or Grab Express Pabili. Grab Express Pabili is an on-demand pabili service where we can ask Kuya Grab to buy items for us. So, pwede natin sabihin kay Kuya na pa-deliver ako dito sa bahay namin from this particular store and they ensure that the delivery will arrive within an hour. So, especially for example, may emergency ka sa bahay and you didn't buy these things beforehand, pwede mong tawagin si Kuya. Kuya Grab Express, pahatid ako ng these things na sinasabi ni si Later kasi kailangan namin as soon as possible. Well, Grab has that for you. Okay, we're back on a rooftop. This is our concrete slab. And a little backstory is that when this house was fairly new, about three months into living here, nag earthquake dito sa Cebu. And nag crack to ng konte, may connection kasi from this part to here. And nag crack ng konte. And if you can see this part, may sealant na siya because there was a little bit of leak happening at the bottom of this. Which leads me to the first thing on our first aid kit, which is the most important, Elastoseal. Elastoseal, I like because you can place it at any time, whether it's raining and it's wet. Pwede mo tong lagyan ng Elastoseal. Parang Elastoseal commercial. <laughs> yeah. But this one is just around 60 pesos and it comes in a pouch form. So you just cut this out, put it in, and then rub it on and you're good to go. And it not only works for this, it also works for roof areas and GI sheets such as this one. Now, yesterday I was talking about finding out where the leaks are coming from. Pag nakikita nyo, okay, it's coming from directly below this one. You go up, hanapin natin yung mga tech screw or yung mga parang bolts na andito. Because that's where mostly the leak is coming from or from mga overlaps from one sheet to another. So, again, this is super effective. You just cut this out. Place it there and yun, you're done. Whether it's wet and raining and you just need to fix a leak right away, this is very, very effective. Or even if it's dry, better. So yeah, Elastoseal, highly recommended. Check them out at Grab Mart or Grab Express. So that was Elastoseal. But if you want something more flexible, more all around, you would want to get something like this, a multi-purpose sealant. This comes in different brands, like this, and different colors. Merong clear, merong black, merong white. And I always have this around because it helps with sealing anything else na, especially pag gusto kong malinis yung finish. And ito yung mga window cells namin. If you have problems with leaks in your mga windows, pwede to gamitin. The only thing that you have to be aware of is when you buy it, get the all-purpose one or the multi-purpose one because there are others that look like this and are also silicone sealants 
but it works for bathrooms. Mas specific yung mga ibang functionalities of things like this. So get the all-purpose version. You'll also want to get a caulking gun like this because this works together. Nilalagay to dito and you squeeze that until the ooze comes out. The ooze. The silicone comes out. And you can just seal whatever you want or whatever you're having a problem with. So again, this is easily available anywhere in all hardware stores. Meron talaga to. And you can use Grab Mart and Grab Express to get this quickly and conveniently. Okay, this was the block from the beginning of our video and is now rock hard. Other side, you still have the hole. And this is what we use to plug it. This is the Watertight 100. Also by Pioneer. Nakarami na si Pioneer sa atin today. But it's very, very effective. Especially when you're trying to plug holes or cracks that are very, very big. So this works only for deep and big cracks that you're trying to seal. So this is fairly cheap. This is like 60 pesos around that range. And when you open this, it's like cement. All you have to do is mix this with water. And as fast as possible, apply it directly because this cures, this hardens really, really fast. So if you're having a problem with water coming through your walls, whether it's just the wall and my floods in the bus or yung mga basement natin, this is a very, very good solution to have. And you can find this on Grab Mart or Grab Express. Guys, when you're using this, make sure you're wearing gloves because it can get a little parang corrosive ng konte sa kamay. So make sure you're using gloves. So these are outdoor doors. And when we were designing this house, hindi namin inakala na papasok yung ulan dito sa baba going towards the room inside. Because meron kaming overhang. But since we're in the mountains and paminsan sobrang lakas talaga ng hangin, may mga pumapasok pa rin from here going inside. That was before we applied this thing. This is the Raven weather strip door seal. So, parang may double-sided tape and you just stick it in here and may rubber siya na gasket to prevent yung mga salibo. Salibo? Sabi sa salibo. I don't know Tagalog. <laughs> From going inside the room and so far, this has been very, very effective for us. So, this is easily available in all the hardware stores and you can just use Grab Express or Grab Mart to purchase one of these things if you're having the same problem. Merending version for the side of the doors, merending version for windows and window sills. So these are very, very effective. Just stick it on there and call it a day. So when I was growing up, my dad always told me the number one problem to look out for with any construction project is water. And ito yung mga suggestions na binigay din niya sa akin, yung sinishare ko sa inyo ngayon. Whether it's preparation or whether it's just things to have handy around the house. And I hope this video has been helpful for you guys, especially this coming rainy season. And I'll see you later.